channel, No Mirror Needed, where we make videos on a ton of topics such as lifestyle, fashion, beauty, fitness, anything that's just going to help us live our best life possible. So today I have a super fun video for you. We are going to be cleaning out my closet and I have a ton of clothes to go through, but I have a ton of clothes and last week I did a video on how you can shop your wardrobe and build a really sustainable capsule wardrobe using the pieces that are already in your closet. We're still on like a restricted lockdown here in New York City, so I didn't want to spend a ton of money on a new wardrobe. So I encouraged everyone to shop the clothes that they already have in their closet and reuse them and just figure out a way to fall in love with them again. Just accessorize, put together a more of a reusable wardrobe where you can pretty much last the entire season. So that is basically what I'm going to be doing today. I'm going to be minimalizing my wardrobe, getting rid of a ton of clothes, selling them, or I'm going to be donating them and then just keeping obviously the things that I just can't part with. Now, I am a clothes Quarter. I love clothes. I love to shop. My problem is, is like, I like the way they look on the hanger and then I don't like the way they look on me and I just don't get rid of them because I buy stuff that I think just looks pretty and that I'm going to like, but then I sometimes never actually end up wearing them. I wear the same clothes that I feel the most comfortable in and basically my clothes just sit there. So some of these items are not going to be for you. Let's face it, everyone has a different style. So some of these clothes you may not like, and that's okay. We all have a different style. So let's just go ahead and get started. I already pulled out a ton of bags. Now these bags usually sit in my storage facility because I have absolutely no room in my house. So I have like three or four huge bags right now. So we're just gonna go through them and then separate them. My big closet's actually in the back room. So I'm gonna film as much as I can here. So I may be moving from room to room. So we'll just see, you know, where this clean out takes us. But it's a rainy day. I have the window open, so I apologize if you hear some outside noise. It's just, if I don't leave the window open, it's gonna be super, super hot in here. So let's see what we have in this bag. So. So I had gotten this beige skirt years ago. This is from New York and Company. This skirt I actually paid $5 for because I had a bunch of coupons. So I feel like a skirt like this, you buy once and you never throw it out. Um, so I'm gonna actually wound up keeping them. Another New York and Company finds. A lot of my clothes are gonna be either from The Gap, New York and Company, Lulu's, Vici doll collection. This is just a flowy olive green skirt shirt i feel like again this is something that um is still in style right now it will go really good with a pair of jeans white button down everyone needs a white button down in their life this i believe is brand new again it is from new york and company my puffer vest from the gap will keep this because i just got this last year Next up, we have these really cute olive green shorts from J. Crew Factory. I tend to not get rid of shorts because I feel like if I ever go on vacation, shorts just never really, to me, go out of style because they're just a piece that's more of accessory to me. This skirt is actually one of my favorite skirts. It has this really cool pattern on it. It has really full colors to it. This is really cute with some um, high knee boots. I will keep one skirt out just in case for like the holidays or something. It's a kind of really full pattern. So we'll go ahead and keep those. I have a denim skirt from J. Crew. This dress is so old. I got this dress. I actually tried it on the other day to see if it still fit. I got this dress from H&M. I want to say a good... 10 years ago it's just a really long brown dress i feel like something like this again will never go out of style it's long sleeve and it just has like a tie at the neck this is one of my favorite jackets i got this from the gap like two years ago um this is definitely still in style um it's in a size small it's like that fleece material super cute to just throw on so we'll keep this out and then I have a bunch of sweaters in here. I have this cable knit sweater from Old Navy. I have this oversized pink sweater. I got this from like ASOS a couple of years ago. But again, this is something that's still in style. It has like a V-neck back with a tie. So it's really cute. You can tuck this in with a pair of jeans. Oversized sweatshirt dress. I feel like you could definitely get a lot of use out of this. 
I think I have this in pink as well. So we'll put this in the maybe pile. This is a really old sweatshirt from, I think this is from Our Pastel. So we'll put this in the donate pile. Hi, baby girl. She's like in the middle of all of this. I got these things off of Amazon for like super cheap and they really are cheap quality. They totally broke. They didn't even last like one season, but all right, this is where we are going to, you know what, I'm going to just go grab a garbage bag and I'll be right back. cardigan or long cardigan I've gotten this from Target I'm putting this in the donate pile I never wear my favorite sweater it's like one of those chenille I think that's how you say it sweaters I've been wearing this a ton I actually paid five dollars from the sweater a fleece zip up jacket that I got from our pastel years ago I've never worn it I was gonna sell it but the tie on the bottom is like overstretched so I think I'm just gonna put it into the donate this I shrunk. It's from J. Crew. It was like 98% merino wool and I wound up shrinking it. But like I like to wear it with layered with like a uh, button down with the collar sticking out and the long sleeves. Like it's literally like I'm in clueless. Because you know me, I'm stuck in the 90s. I can't get out. I just want to dress like, you know, Alicia Silverstone and clueless. I got this sweater from Beachy Dolls. I keep that. Other cable knit from ralph lauren this is a brand new sweater from new york and company i've never worn it i'm gonna put this to the sale pot i have a red sweater cable knit sweater from j crew i paid so much money for the sweater and has a pull in it so i need to try and get this pull out um these i'm actually selling i already have these up on my poshmark account i got these from new york and company and i hate them they're like uh, wide legged they're kind of a linen palazzo pan or more of a parachute pant, but for the size medium, they're, they're a little big on me. So we are going to be selling them. So they're already up on Poshmark as much as well as this cropped cardigan. This is from Jones, New York collection. It's just like red and gray and black, like speckles, um, with these really big buttons and it's, it's really, really cute, but I know I never wear it. So I'm going to sell it then i have these faux leather leggings that i got from amazon um and i just bought the spanx ones so i actually don't need these anymore so i'm gonna sell them i only wore them once so these are on sale well as this black new york and company never been worn before a-line skirt with the buttons down the middle this is also for sale um on my account from pink it's a workout jacket we're gonna keep this because it's really cute it's teal it has a pocket in the back and I still really wear this when I go to the gym or when I work out so we will keep this um, I just did a video where I went over a bunch of slimming leggings and uh, a bunch of uh, sports bras as well as some biker shorts so I will leave a link to that video above so you can check that out if you are interested in some of my favorite slimming high-waisted leggings um, these are them so I talked about some of these items already in that video so you could just head over there and check it out but I have this champion sports bra I wear this all the time I'm gonna keep probably like two bathing suits out just in case this but this is a really cute red bikini that I got from Amazon I love this bikini um, but this we don't need this out we'll put that in storage really cute tank I got it has 
Janice, Patty, Stevie, Nico, and Joni. All the great singers, Stevie Nicks, Joni Mitchell, Janice Joplin. Love this, we'll keep this in our workout drawer. These biker shorts I got off of Amazon. They're absolutely horrific. We will put these to the donate pile. No one should ever wear them. Okay, my biker shirts I'm gonna keep. So these are my infinity ones, we'll keep those. Here's my Zell leggings from Nordstrom Rack. Love them, we'll keep these. Okay, biker shorts, these leopard biker shorts. I got these from Amazon. Great company if you're on the hunt for biker shorts. Definitely check out that video, but these are great. Amazon. I think the camera cut me off, but I was saying I have two of the brand new high support. They're from Old Navy. I love them. Um, I have them in this like very light pink and in purple, and I have the black on today. So these are definitely going to, I'm actually going to go into the closet and I'm going to organize this and just separate it so it's a little neater so we can bring some more stuff in. Um, so I'm not just keep piling stuff to this pile, but I'm going to go and bring some things from the closet just to show you and organize some stuff. But then eventually we're going to need it to make our way into that closet. So I am going to organize this and I will be right back. Okay guys, so I'm actually in my closet now in the back room. So I have only this side to really go through and there's some other stuff like headed into the back there, which are more like coats and just stuff that I know like dresses and stuff like that. So we are just gonna get started. I'm not gonna do any of the shoes today. I feel like that's just an abundance of stuff. It's too much. I'll make this video super, super long. I'm just gonna go through some of these sweatshirts that I have and stuff. so Let's just dive right into it. So this is a sweater from J. Crew. Um, I threw out the other white sweater because it was actually stained. So I'll keep this one. This is more like a, of an off cream. I don't know where I'm gonna put any of the stuff. The bed is right in front of me. That's usually where I pile everything, but I have the camera set up and the lights set up. So I don't know, it's gonna make it a little difficult. This sweatshirt is really cute. It's teal. I got this from, I think the lights are washing some of it out. Let me see if I should turn off one of the lights. That actually might be better. This shirt is teal, it's a sweatshirt. I got this from Kohl's. This sweatshirt's from The Gap. This is super, super old. We'll put this to the donate pot. This sweatshirt is so cute. It has a leopard on the back. I wear this a lot actually with some jeans. It's so, I got this at a really cute boutique that actually closed down by my house, but I will keep this because I just think it's just a really cute statement piece. My Adidas sweatshirt. I actually got some Clorox on the sleeve when I was washing it once. I don't care, I'll wear it anyway. Tie-dye sweatshirt I got from Vici Doll Collection last season. So cute. This is actually the sweatshirt that gave me the inspiration to tie-dye all those clothes. I'll leave a link to my tie dyeing video above so you can check that out. This pink sweatshirt, this can probably go in the trash. It's super stained, really old. We can get rid of that. This sweatshirt is from Old Navy. I've worn this a ton, so cute. Um, I will keep this. And then this one, I actually don't really like this this much. It's just like a coral sweatshirt. Oh, I have this white sweatshirt. We can keep this old. I think I got this from ASOS. We'll throw this out. It's really stained everywhere. These pixie pants I got from Vici Doll Collections. I wear these a ton. They're really cute to like dress up when you go out. This is more of a spring pant. This is one of the sweatshirts I tie dyed. It's hard to see. I shut one of the lights off, but it's uh, getting a little washed out. It's a navy blue tie dyed sweatshirt. I made this myself. These linen pants I got from Old Navy. 
I never actually got to wear these. Another pair of pixie pants. These are pink. Again, I was going to wear these, you know, this summer or spring with like a white cami. So cute. Nothing. These are my boyfriend's pants. All right, here's some jeans. These jeans are so cute. These are like a bell bot. Oh no, not these. These are express. They have rips on the knees. Really cute. I actually wear these a lot because it's light wash. I like any type of like light wash jeans. And these, oh my God, these are my favorite jeans. These are from Levi's. These are the high waisted, what are these called? They're the high waisted 501. Oh my God, I love these. These fit so good. They, I love them. They have a rip right here. I will never get rid of these jeans. Love them. So we will keep these. Literally about a thousand t-shirts. So I know that some of these t-shirts are going to need to go in the trash. And this I wear a lot. This is from J. Crew. It's one of those sweater tanks. This I'll keep. And then I really should put this to like go wear this to the gym. It's from Victoria's Secret. It says Angel 10 on it. And then all of these are shorts. So most likely I am going to keep most of these shorts because I feel like, like I said, like shorts to me never go out of style. Let's just see if anything's like, okay, so we have the pink tie dye to match that set. I have these fuchsia pink ones. These are from J. Crew. These are like a pair of chinos. These are just water shorts. Um, these are cute. Where did I get these? Oh, these are from J. Crew too. These black and white ones fit so nice. These are from New York and Company. These linen ones we're gonna get rid of. I don't like them. These are cute. I got these at Mandy's. These as well, I got at Mandy's. Um, I know that most of the things here we're keeping because I just did that entire video and I pulled out a lot of stuff for the capsule wardrobe video. So definitely the denim button down from Old Navy. And we have a white cami. This is brand new. This is from New York and Company. I just did the video on this. It has these really pretty buttons down the back. This is great for like holidays. And we have a white cardigan, short sleeve. And I also, this was part of my video. This black and white romper from Lulu's. So cute. Sweater tank. This was part of my video. This I'm going to keep. And these are brand new. These are the beige linen boyfriend pants. This romper is from Lulu's. It is this really pretty crocheted romper. It's like shorts with these bell sleeves. So cute. I got this to wear on my birthday this year. Never got to wear it. This is from Beachy Doll Collection. This is brand new. I got this over the spring. Um, we'll leave this. This will look cute if we go out with like a pair of jeans out to dinner or something. We have another cami. These I think I'm going to get rid of. I don't think I'm ever going to wear these anymore. My guest leather jacket. This again, I didn't get to wear. We got it last season at the outlets. 
I think it was at Wilson's Leather I wound up getting this. This dress is so cute. This is from Lulu's as well. It's like a shift dress, navy blue with this really pink flower design on it. I wear this a lot actually. We'll keep this out. A floral maxi dress. This leopard maxi dress that I got, we'll leave this out. This is from Beachy Doll Collection. The baby doll dress that I got, just got from Lulu's. This is a three tier baby doll dress. It has three buttons on the back, super cute. guys I'm back in my bedroom so I'm just gonna finish cleaning up this mess put away my workout clothes go through some of my intimates and get rid of some of those things um, put away my work clothes and I'm probably not going to be listing anything today I just am so tired I definitely have been doing this for a couple hours now but I really hope you enjoyed this video I know it was different it's fun um, maybe a little curious as to what is in someone else's closet um, and compare it to your own. Again, this is just my style. These are the things I like. So if you don't like them, that's okay. We all have a different type of style, which is totally fine. So guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you're new to my channel, please like, subscribe. Make sure you hit that notification bell. I make videos every week on a ton of topics. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for your views. You have no idea how appreciative it is. I actually gained three subscribers over the last couple of weeks, so I am super grateful for that. And for now, guys, I hope you're enjoying your three-day weekend. But for now, I'll see you guys real soon. Bye.